His name is Sultan Gustav al Ghazali, or the world known him simply as Ghazali. A 22 year old college student from Indonesia. His name suddenly rose to fame after his collection of selfie pictures NFT, Ghazali Everyday, suddenly went viral. He is so famous that his pictures even get turned into memes. Now, Gozali is one of the newest millionaire of NFT. He even received a congratulations tweet from the Department of Taxation Office. The tax office then continue with sending him a link to pay taxes from his earnings. But it is not always like that. It's all started from a humble beginning back in 2017. An 18-year-old Gozali just planned to make a time-lapse video transformation of himself, from a fresh college student, up until his graduation later. So he started to take a selfie picture of himself every day from 2017 until 2021. Little did he know, this simple little plan would change his life forever. Around the end of December 2021, he decided to upload those selfie pictures as NFT to the OpenSea just for fun. He did not expect anything more. He went on to promote his NFT on Twitter. Apparently his tweet was noticed by an NFT activist, which was then shared to an NFT community group WhatsApp. One of the member of the group is a celebrity chef named Arnold. He jokingly compared the Gozali's collection to Beeple's collage. For your information, Beeple's collage sold at $69 million, making one it of one of the most of the expensive and celebrity sold chef in history. Named Arnold. He then went on to buy 30 of Gozali's NFT just for fun. He said, at the very least the money would help Gozali finance his tuition. Gozali ended up selling 33 of his collection on the first day. All that sold to one person, Chef Arnold. Meanwhile Gozali surprised to find out that someone actually want to buy his NFT. By the third day, all his 933 selfie pictures collection have already sold out. Priced at 0.001 Ethereum or $3.50 each, he ended up earning around $3,265 in three days. However his big earning actually come from the 10% royalty. Every time his NFT sold, he would get 10%, and this would go on forever. As long as his NFT are still on demand, he would get the 10%. I am one of those persons that actually bought his NFT. I bought this particular NFT at $860 and managed to sell it three days later at around $1,600. Using my transaction as an example, Gozali would earn $86 royalty when I bought it, and also earn another $160 when I sold it. This is only for my transaction. His NFT have been traded thousands of times, and will still continue to be traded. Can you imagine the amount of money he would get? When interviewed by Deddy Corbuser, a top Indonesian podcaster, he admitted he has earned around $120,000 so far. But he only cashed out $2,570, or about 0.8 Ethereum for personal need, he planned to use his earning to help his parents. He also planned to open an animation studio after he graduated. When asked if these are his first and last NFT, he said he would still considering taking more pictures. Especially the one with him in graduation uniform. He also said he would considered making 3D animation NFT in the future. 
So congratulations to Gozali, you have now become a household name. Please stay humble. I wish you all the success in the future. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. I plan to launch my own NFT very soon. Hopefully you can join in early. Bye for now.